Hey people, and welcome back to Every Show Review. Today we are going to be continuing our current series over mistakes you missed in TV shows. Today we're going to be listing off all the mistakes you missed in Hannah Montana. This is going to be really hard for me personally because I love the show, but geez, they definitely had their issues. So anyway, let's dive into it. Number one, the set. Okay, it's Disney, so obviously they didn't really care that much about how realistic the set looked, especially since back then the quality was so bad, but the beach set was just so unrealistic. I mean, every time there's a scene on the beach, the background is so fake. First off, the waves never move, and second off, they never even show the other side of the beach. Like, it's a huge beach, and we only get to see, like, maybe a tenth of it. Like, why just spend all of your time in one area? Number two, The Secret. I could talk for hours about how it's totally unrealistic for no one to figure out Miley's big secret, which, yes, is sad, and it's a Disney show, so obviously it isn't that realistic or realistic in the slightest for that matter, but come on, I've had to bring it up. Okay, first off, how does one never follow Hannah home? Ever. I mean, the paparazzi followed her home, like, once, but they never did any investigating at all, I guess, because they just ignored the fact that there's a girl that lives in that home that looks exactly like Hannah and lives there with her dad, which leads me to the dad. He is a famous country singer, Billy Ray, as both Hannah's dad and Miley's dad. Right there is a huge plot hole, and if Hannah was so famous, I am pretty sure someone could do just a bit of investigating and they would find out that it was her. If she's such a big pop star, I can't believe no one figured out that she's missing for like three-fourths of the day, but okay. Number three, plot holes. There are little things in the movie in particular. Remember at the end where Miley sings the climb to the whole audience? She announces that it's a new song that she just finished writing, yet moments later, the audience begins to sing along, knowing all of the words, of course. Also, she revealed herself to thousands of people, and not one soul tells the rest of the world who she is. I mean, I'm all for believing in the good of people, but that's just insanity. Someone would have said something. Number four, set mistakes. The show also had a lot of visible production errors. For example, when Hannah and Lily walk into Rob Reiner's office, a light is reflected on Hannah's large black sunglasses. These are the studio lights they use on Disney Channel sets. In the episode, The Way We Almost Weren't, at the end of the episode when Lily and Oliver are lying on the floor glued to chairs, you can pretty easily see the black strips on their backs attaching them to the chairs. In another episode, when Robbie Ray walks out on the porch where Jackson is grunting, working out, the reflections of the camera and a couple of crew members, one wearing a white shirt that is pretty visible on the glass door behind Jackson. And in another episode, Would I Lie to You, while on her train for the class trip in Washington, just as Molly stands up before she elbows Oliver in the chest, a boom mic can be visible on the top right of the screen before it pulls out of the shot. If you rewatch the show, there's a lot more of this that's pretty visible. Anyway, that's all we're going to do for today. I hope you guys enjoyed. I know it was short, but I could go on and on with just little things like that. But after a while, it would get a little boring. So if you enjoyed, check out the rest of our videos in this series by clicking the playlist on your screen, like Mistakes in Disney Channel's Jesse and Liv and Maddie. Comment down below some shows you would like us to do next time, and I might just give you guys a shout out if I like your idea. Also, please check out the latest episode of my show Gracie 101. I spent a lot of time on that and I would love your guys' support. If you're new to every show review, make sure you subscribe for new videos every Sunday. I'm Hayden, I love you guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys!